hey everybody i'm back with uh, another video so yes this is a collective read if this resonates be sure to comment below all right so let's go ahead thank you spirit for these messages give me a message for the collective please All right, so we got heartbroken, stabbed in the back, and I like you. Okay. I feel like someone definitely got betrayed. Someone got betrayed. Tell me more. Oh, wow. This person is spying on you. Someone is spying on you. This could be a twin flame. You and your twin flame could be in separation currently. And you're focused on healing and evolving and your abundance and making better decisions i feel like a lot of y'all are healing from um some uh situation that you were very passionate about you and this person could have been married you and this person could have been together for a while this person ended up stabbing you in the back now, for some of you, um, this is something that you're currently trying to get past or currently working on getting over, but some of y'all got a crush. I feel like this is a new energy, though. I feel like this, this, uh, I like you and addiction. I feel like somebody is, I already see that somebody stalking y'all, somebody watching y'all, possibly online, um, but I feel like you're healing from this situation. And you have a brand new opportunity in front of you. But the thing about this person is that they are addicted to you. They can't get enough of you. Mm. The person that you were dealing with, I feel like it could have been a twin flame. Um, so we're going to use this twin flame deck and let's see what messages we get from there. Because I feel like y'all got somebody, a new energy that's around y'all or that wants to come in. Somebody's trying to manifest their way into your energy. Yeah, see, we got bound. <laughs> so this person could be money hungry, could be greedy. This person could, your uh, twin flame could be focused right now on the material world. Their focus is on money. They're trying to play victim. They tried to play victim in the situation. When the deception was involved, they tried to play it, make it seem like it wasn't their fault, that it was the other party's fault or your fault. That's the reason why they're out here lying, sneaking, cheating. But the truth of it is, is it's some money involved in the situation. We got reinvention here at the bottom of the deck and separation. So I feel like you're separated from this person and this person could have reinvented themselves. They have completely reinvented themselves. They feel like you're not gonna understand where they're coming from. This person that reinvented themselves, they're 
possibly in another connection with the karmic. This could have happened in the summer that just passed. And then we got spring here. June, July, August type of um, energy here. This could have happened in those months. So it could have been maybe six to seven months ago. Yeah, this person, you are in separation from this person. Um, this person, they had a fear of surrendering to you. Now they're letting the divine, they're saying, look, if it's meant to be, we will be. Look at this. We got divine timing. We got release. And we got a twin flame. So they didn't want to, because we got the answer is no fear and surrender. They didn't want to surrender. Um, they didn't want to do what they needed to do to make this connection work. So they are still, you and this person, you and your twin flame are still in separation. They're choosing money over this connection. And there's definitely, they're going to return. But the thing about it is, is, they're still going to be telling lies. They're still going to be deceptive. We got return. And then we got deceptive, deception. So they could possibly be trying to make their way back to you this summer. But the thing about it is, is they still got some third-party mess going on, lies, cheating, stealing, whatever. But they are definitely sitting here watching you. They're watching your every move. Let's find out about, I feel like y'all got some new energy coming in. I feel like y'all got an admirer, somebody who, uh, that likes you a lot, who's checking you out, could be checking you out online. Let's talk about this new energy that's coming in. What is, what is uh, this new energy that Collective has coming towards them? I'm telling you, this person, whoever this person is, like, this person really, like, they are, like, acting like they so in love with you. Y'all got somebody that real deal. We got the three of pentacles. This person, I'm telling you, king of cups, two of cups. I'm telling you, whoever this person is, could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This person really wants to be in a connection with you. This person really likes you. Queen of Wands. Justice could be a Libra or a... Um, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Mm, we got the page of ones want to come out in reverse. Nine of Cups and the Knight of Swords and the Moon. All right. I feel like this person is hiding how they really feel. Let's find out. I'm getting some type of message, like um, maybe like a group chat, or um, I'm getting like a DM inbox. That's what I'm hearing. Inbox. This person could be trying to talk to you online, and they could be hopping in your inbox.
could be a cancer. But this person could see you. Because look at this, the hermit. And look at this, the hermit, the hangman, and the two of cups. And the ten of swords. This person has been watching you, eyeing you, waiting. I'm talking about waiting for your past relationship to end. Two of cups and the ten of swords. They've been waiting for this to end. <laughs> Oh, gosh. Wow. King of Wands, Queen of Wands. This could be a fire sign. Look at this. This person, there's a lot of passion here. Like, this person could be really handsome as well, too. Very good looking. Very beautiful. I got that go-getter energy. But I'm definitely seeing them reaching out to you. Messaging you. The Page of Cups. I see them reaching out to you. But I don't know. Are you not responding? Because the Page of Wands is in the reverse. This could be somebody that y'all got sent in your inbox that you did not respond to. Maybe because this person could... Um, oh, this person could be married. This person could already have something going on. This person could already be in a connection, so you're not even checking the messages because the moon in the emperor is kind of giving me like side piece vibes. Um, why is the four of wands here? Eight of swords, okay. Someone could be stuck in some type of connection, stuck in the house. Like, I, I just feel like you're ignoring, I'm getting ignoring this person messages. Um... And I feel like they all up in your inbox. Maybe they tried something before. You're like, nah, you tried that the last time. <laughs> you tried that before. That ain't going to work this time. person could be a Virgo. This person is trying to get your attention. They've been looking for your attention. Okay, they were trying to find a way to get your attention for the longest. They could be considering jumping in your inbox or they could be getting ready to jump in your inbox or have already been in your inbox. And I feel like you're ignoring their uh, their messages. Um, yep, no response. <laughs> You're not responding to their messages, okay? I got the Dove, Page of Cups, and the Four of Cups in their disappointment. Um, they just want to see if you're single. They want to see if you're single. So y'all do got to admire. Now, the Moon card is here as the outcome, the Knight of Swords, and the Moon card again. Somebody is a hustler. <laughs> Somebody said they've been waiting a long time for this moment. They've been waiting for whatever you've been dealing with or who you've been dealing with. They've been waiting for that to end. Somebody feels like, some, I'm getting somebody is a, like a go-getter. Could be a boss with the emperor and the ten of pentacles. Um, they move real swift. Um, like they're they're really quick pace fast pace kind of like live a fast life but that ten of pentacles and that emperor here this is somebody could be a little bit older could be an aries this person thinks you're sexy as hell, we got the devil and the star. This person thinks you're very good looking and attractive. Okay, so y'all do have an admirer. I feel like while you're healing, um, I feel like a lot of y'all just aren't into, you know, like the dating online or really paying this person no attention. And it could possibly be because you know that this person could already be in some type of connection already. Or you heard that this person could have already been in something. So you're not trying to be, you know, not trying to really deal with that type of energy. 
Let me grab another card here. Let's see what this person wants to say. Let's see what your twin flame wants to say. And then we're going to see what this first got to say. What is your twin? What does the collective twin flame want to say to the collective? Oh, well, geez. <laughs> My life is not as put together as it seems. You speak to me through music. So songs are reminding them of you. Um, and they may be coming off. Like online and stuff, or you heard that is that they're doing this, they're doing that. It's not really together as it seems. It's not. All right, so let's see what this crush, this crush got to say. How does this crush feel? They can't stop thinking about you. But think about this is they scared to let you get close to them. We got I can't let you get too close. And I want to tell you how I feel. Um, like I said, this kind this person kind of like hiding a little bit, trying to disguise something. Um, like I said, they may have already contacted you or they're considering contacting you. I feel like they have already contacted you because your energy is already like not responding. So I feel like they want to talk to you. They want to tell you how they feel, but they don't. They're afraid to let you to get too close to you. But they think about you all the time. Like it's like they. This person is obsessed. Like what is this? I can't stop thinking of you. Like for some of you, this is someone new. For some of you, this may be an ex returning. All right. So y'all, let me know what's going on in the comment section below, and I'm gonna chat with y'all later. Ciao.